Good afternoon, butterflies. This is the Awaken Butterfly, and I am back with another video. If this is your first time coming across my channel, please stay for the entire video. If you enjoy the content, please don't hesitate to subscribe. Welcome and welcome back. How was your weekend? I pray that you all had a blessed and amazing weekend. I pray that you all are taking care of yourselves mentally, physically, and spiritually. I pray that everyone is in a great headspace. I love you all, and I really appreciate all of my genuine, true supporters. Your support is greatly appreciated, and it's what motivates me to continue to post content on this channel. Also, the Most High has set out for me to do some different things with this channel, and I knew that once I started to follow his instructions and talk about certain things on the channel that it would make some people shy away. And I just want you all to know that although I talk a lot about spiritual attacks such as gang stalking, electronic weapons, things of that nature, all of those things actually goes back to God because they are all in relation to spiritual warfare. So you can't talk about Satan and his evil works without talking about the goodness of the Most High and how he's able to pull you out of all of these demonic attacks that you experience, especially when you're trying to get closer to him. So I just want you all to know that these things go hand in hand. You can't talk about one without talking about the other. The Most High is the truth, life, and salvation for all of us. And just know that your only solution to gang stalking, to witchcraft, to overcoming being hit with electronic weapons is coming to the Most High God. So, yeah, I just wanted to put that out there, guys. Um, as you can tell by the title of this video, we will be talking about waking up between the hours of 3 and 5 a.m. And some reasons why many of you may be doing so. I pray that you all go to the Most High for confirmation pertaining to the information that I'm about to share with you in this video. I'm going to be discussing five reasons why many of you may be waking up between the hours of 3 and 5 a.m. One of those reasons could be that God is trying to get your attention. He could be trying to reveal something to you, something that he's giving you the answer to, pertaining to something that you've prayed about. It can be related to your personal life, your family, job, health, etc. Whatever the situation is, you're currently experiencing or something that you may have experienced in the past. He may also be giving you instructions on what steps to take pertaining to these matters. So that's one reason why the Most High can be waking you up between these hours. Another reason could be that God has chosen you for something and wants to reveal it to you as well as instructions towards your purpose. During these hours, it is very important to pay attention to dreams, visions, and God's voice. Pray for discernment before taking dreams, visions, voice, and voices as confirmation because Satan does play mind games and causes spiritual attacks between the hours of 3 and 4 a.m., which we all know as the witching hour. During this time, a lot of things take place in the spiritual realm. Between the hours of 3 and 5, there are a lot of spiritual warfare that takes place. There's a lot of attacks. There's a lot of spell casting. There's a lot of opening of demonic portals, which has caused many of you to have nightmares and to undergo sleep paralysis. If you are waking up between these hours, God wants you to pray. Protection over you, your family, your loved ones. Pray that... He places a fire hedge of protection around you all during this time of spiritual warfare. A lot of the times when God wakes us up between these hours, it's because 
we're being heavily attacked in the spiritual realm and he wants us to wake up so we can pray to fight off these attacks god may also place specific people on your mind because they may be going through something and he wants you to pray for them or he could be trying to warn warn you of something pertaining to this person or people it could they could have something to do with the spiritual attacks and some setbacks that you may have been experiencing in your life so the most high may be showing you these people so you can pray against what they're trying to do or he could be showing you these people because he wants you to pray for them because they're going through something. So once he shows you these people's faces, make sure you put, you pray for clarity and you listen quietly for God's voice. Make sure at this time you are not undergoing any type of distractions so you can actually hear what the Most High is trying to say to you. Also at this time, the Most High may want you to use that time to pray for healing and restoration over their life. Pray for God to touch their hearts. Even if these people are, if he's revealed to you that these people are trying to do something to hurt you, still pray for these people. Pray for the Most High to step in and change their hearts because the Most High does want us to pray for our enemies. And in the midst of their wicked plots and schemes against us, the Most High is going to protect us. And the reason why he does reveal these things to us because they will come to pass. He may also want you to pray for protection over yourself, your family, and your loved ones at the time as well. Pertaining to anyone trying to cast any spiritual attacks on you and your family. Another reason God may be waking you up between the hours of 3 and 5 is, is because he just wants your undivided attention. He wants to spend time with you. He wants you to make a routine habit to make personal time with him. Because, you know, our daily lives are usually so so full of work, our families, our own personal things that we have going on. Sometimes we're distracted by so many things that we don't make time for God. We don't hear his voice. We don't get into his word because we're so distracted with everything else. God wants you to make this time for prayer and for worship. And he wants you to do it at a quiet time when there's no distractions. And usually between the hours of 3 and 5 a.m., people are usually asleep at that time. Especially when it's you know pertaining to a household. Also, this is the time for you to get yourself more equipped more spiritually equipped, as well as mental and physical preparation as well. Because especially if the Most High has built you and called you to do something spiritual, he wants you to stay equipped on all three levels so you will be strong enough to do what he called you to do as well as handle the attacks that come with that. The Most High wants you to use this time to pray, to give gratitude to him for everything that he has done for you, everything that he continues to do for you, and everything that he will do for you. This is also a time that the Most High wants you to repent for any sins that you may have committed willingly or unwillingly. This is the time... To get right for the return of the Most High Yah. And although neither one of us know when that day will be, it's never too late to prepare for his return. And that's through prayer, fasting, and repentance. And God wants you to use those hours to personally do that with him. This is also the time that the Most High wants you to ask him for anything that you may be seeking in your life. Whether it's protection, peace, health, clarity, financial breakthrough, or anything pertaining to your family, friends, and loved ones. This is your time to come to the Most High with any request that you may have. 
for any of you who may find yourself waking up between the hours of 3 and 5 a.m., this is your time to spend with God. Go to your prayer closet, your bathroom, or wherever you have made a prayer spot. You can also play some worshiping music. This is your time for prayer. This is your time to sit there and quietly listen for God's voice. This is your time to pay attention to any dreams and visions that you may be having at that time. And in the midst of all of this, make sure you still ask the Most High for confirmation regarding these visions, these dreams, and these instructions. Also, go to the Most High for confirmation as well pertaining to this video. I pray that this video helps someone. I pray that this video answers a lot of your questions as to why you have been waking up between the hours of 3 and 5 a.m. Like I said, make sure you please pray to the Most High for further confirmation. I love you guys so much. Continue to take care of yourselves mentally, physically, and spiritually. And until the next video, peace and blessings. Mwah.